Hi guys, welcome to today's uh, DSS video. Uh, today I'm going to be featuring the two Oliver Hazard Perry classes. The one with the skin is the left one over here and the normal version is the one on the right. Uh, so I have my friend over here who got the, his version of the normal uh, skin. And we're going to compare the two, see where they are better and if it's really worth it for getting this skin. So. What we're going to be looking at, first of all, is going to be the uh, exterior detail or any different features from the first one to the second one. As you can see, first of all, there's not much difference. Uh, on the bridge, well, on the top of the superstructure, we have this little thing right here. I think that's a laser to uh, aim or like uh, calculate how far uh, the other ships or enemies are. Then, the other thing you might have seen is the missiles. So this front missile is uh, uh, a normal one, and this one is a blue one. We're going to test out if they do the same amount of damage or not. And the second thing you might have seen is over here, you have this little uh, lines and box right here. But on the skinned version, there is a vertical launch system, a VLS system. So what this does, this is automatically deployed. You have uh, eight of these. And if a missile is inbound, this will launch a missile upwards into the sky and defend you from the incoming missile. So it's kind of a missile that hits another missile, so anti-missile uh, defense. Uh, this ship doesn't have it, but it both has the seaweeds, or the phalanx, if you can see that on the back right here. One second, I'm gonna get there. So this is the phalanx, this is the same still. Uh, as you can see, not much difference at the back, besides the lines over there. So this is the normal version again, and this is the skinned version. But uh, there's not much difference to the back over here, besides that there is place like this stuff. The fence is placed downwards, ready for helicopters to land, and this one is upwards. But besides that, not much difference, as you can see, a little bit of patterns, a little bit of piping there on the walls. Personally, quite cool. No hangers, as you can see right here. I think you can still go in. Yeah, no problem. This is, should be the same. Yeah. Well, we're gonna go take a look on the top of the ship. Yeah, let's go up here. This should be the same. Yes, okay, so still the Otomelera over here. Both uh, ships, both ships have the phalanx. Uh, still the torpedo tubes as well. So this one is covered. This one has a little uh, extra deck over here, as you can see. So that is also different. We also have these little hangy things. It's really cool. Um, God, I can't get back up. One second. Okay, there we go. Uh, not much difference at the uh, the main towers, but. It seems pretty alright. So I think this is it. Also the numbers change. That is as well. Um, I am going to be trying to get shot by one of these missiles. Alright. So what I'm wondering is if this missile is uh, better than the other one. I am doubting that it is any different. So we'll see. Uh, they should be the same, but the only difference is the VLS system, really. You can see that right here, this is the blue one. And this deploys automatically, so it will shoot up in the air. It should look really cool. And um, it will take out the incoming missile. Just like the phalanx in the back, as you can see over there. Uh, yeah, nice demonstration. Uh, why is it firing in the water? <laughs> okay. Uh, what is there? See here, nothing special. Why is it doing that? That's weird. Well, you can't control the uh, phalanx. That's you can't do anything about that. So we're gonna rearm here. This should go up. Yeah, there we go. Eight. Now we have eight of them. Good to know. Okay. So my friend is gonna join me here in a bit. Uh, let's see. He's gonna shoot me, so that's gonna be very cool. Okay, there we go. I took 10 damage. Ten percent damage. 
Good to know. So now I'm going to fire at you. I think that the result is going to be the same though. So we're going to see if I can hit him from here. Missile is out. Okay, that's way too low. Did I hit him? That is the question. Hit. Damage, question mark. 10%. Okay, so that is the same. Uh, I know it's kind of hard for you guys to see over here, but... Uh, I got 10% damage, and my friend here in the chat also has 10% damage. So, uh, the, gun, the gun should be the same. Uh, I can test that too. One second. Let me see if I can angle the camera on right. See damage. One percent. Oh. So the automanera only does one damage. That seems weird. That seems really off. Okay, so yeah, there you go. It deploys. It's way too late, but it deploys. I think I'm uh, a bit too close. So yeah, I took 10% uh, damage again. But as you can see over here is the vertical launch system. It doesn't work that good. Maybe it's because of the distance. What was that? Was that from him? I don't know. That's weird. Okay. But yeah. Uh, the vertical launch system doesn't work that good. Oh yeah, there we go. That took out a missile. Let's see. That flew straight under me, I believe. Let's see if the VLS system really works. So as you can see... Okay, no it doesn't. It's kind of broken, but it's super cool. I was thinking that maybe it would be better... What? My, my phalanx! Uh, okay. Whoa! Okay, yeah, they are aware of the bug that the, uh... Okay, it's alright, it's alright. Shoot me one time with the turret. Let's see how much damage we do. 1% again. Alright, that's good to know. So, uh... The Auto Malera is not really any good. I'm going to try to shoot him too. Let's see how much damage that does. I think this is going to be doing a lot more damage, because, uh ship's armor. Yeah, there we go. So he took 8 damage in um, the hydrofoil from the Automalera and this ship can take a hundred of them. So this is really armored compared to this one. Uh, yeah. Okay, there we go. So that's 10 damage. 10%. I'm gonna let him know. Now I am going to fire a missile at him, if I can see him. There he is. Let's see if we can hit him. Okay, did we do? Damage? Question mark? I really like the missile. 62 damage! Okay, so that's amazing. Um, yeah, so I think... Yeah. I think it's 60 damage or something like that. So the missile is way better against the smaller ships because they have way less armor and the OHP has a ton of it, so damage is only going to go up to 10%. Oh, he's on fire already, Jesus. Okay, well that's great to know. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you want to see more of this, feel free to subscribe. Uh, and yeah, I hope this helped you out in thinking about buying this skin or something like that. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I'll talk to you later. Bye bye.